Dude, you really are the Flash. I've never met a superhero before. I know that we're in a situation here, but if we get out of this, I would love to study some of your quantum biochemistry sometime. If we get out? Uh, no. Are we gonna die? Oh, man. No. Hey, nobody is gonna die. No. No, we just need to figure out why these objects keep showing up. I, I have a theory about that. Imagine this is all space time normally it flows and stretches like this we move from one room one moment to the next but, but we can't do that we're stuck because space and time for us has lost elasticity it's like some kind of gravitational force is creating a zone that we can't escape from and pulling objects out of time too it's called a time magnet I really like science fiction, so... We and I was doing research for the map book. I found out that 100 years from now, a weapons vault would be right here. Well, let me guess, one of those weapons will be a time magnet. Why is it here now and not in the future? Unknown, but in order to prevent the temporal anomaly that we're stuck in from happening, this future weapons vault would have paired the time magnet with some kind of stabilizer. So whoever brought the magnet with them from the past forgot to bring the stabilizer with them? Uh, Maybe they were in a hurry. Why would they be in a hurry? Because they were stealing it. Think about it. It could be a thief, a time thief, trying to escape their past to get away. Now, hold on. We, we haven't seen anybody come through here except for the people in this room. You're right. So that means that somebody in this room is a thief let's not jump to conclusions jane is there any way to find out if someone is from a different time theoretically a, a time traveler might give off excess radiation and we have a radiation scanner okay well let's test that theory 